Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Aziza. I'm ready today for the sign of Gemini. Let's see the Gemini. And uh, thank you for subscribing to my channel and welcome new subscribers um, or viewers. And please, if you like my video, describe, subscribe, I'm sorry, um, like, make, uh, leave a comment below. Um, and thank you for the donations. That was really very nice. If you need any private reading, if you need private reading or to contact me, please look at my website, mysticalaziza.com. The information will be below this video in the description box. Thank you. Okay, let's see here about Gemini. Gemini. Okay, Gemini, it looks to me that you are afraid. You are afraid of a new relationship and you are afraid to let go of the past also. Someone from your past, I believe that this person have been really childish in that relationship and you have been really the one who is really like you taking care of everything. You are trying to move on because you have been confused a lot. Okay. The one you love, there is one you are in love with, that you haven't been with, that they were afraid and confused about approaching you. And they have been slowing down, slow down, slow down on everything. They're going to approach you this month. They had a lot of confusion on their mind here. They didn't know what to do. You were confused also what's wrong, what's going on there. They wasn't strong enough to approach you. They have been fearing like, you know, really to step up and take another relationship and leave the other person behind. The other person like, you know, that things are not really working out very much at this time also. You wanted to move on or to move forward, like, you know, with this relationship, with this, the one you are in love with, but you have been disappointed because they talked to you seems to be recently and they did not open up yet and you were trying to read between lines between you and this person also they disappoint you because they were confused still about you and another person like you know how to handle the situation how to deal with it so soon you are going to be really getting this person to open up for you Another person that the ex like you know that want to keep really coming around here seems to be that they are having a cold feet at this time like you no know, they are not really approaching you very much. The ex is sounds to be here that of course they are in love with you and they want you but they feel you like you are not really being connected with them a lot also. So what they are doing at this time that they are trying to be cold and not to do any effort because they did a lot of effort before and you kept pushing them away and you kept being back and forth. The back and forth here, like, you know, they felt like, you know, I, I surrender now. I am not going to do an effort, so I will have the upper hand and I will have the control. So they will be running after me. It seems to be that they are going to be really like, you know, giving you some love or showing you the love or little attention. Then they pull back. Then they come to you and it sounds to be that they have been manipulating you really very much and you don't like it. It goes like you know, with the, the one you are in love with also. They come to you and they show you that they want you and they don't say it. Like you know, they do some action like you, know, you get confused and read between lines. Why they are, they seem jealous of my ex. They seem like you know, that they are caring for me. They look at me with that look like you know, they have that eye on me, really very beautiful. How come they are not really approaching? They are confusing me. Then suddenly they step up and say, okay, good luck, you know, searching for a new person because you don't want to be with your ex anymore. And you are like, what the heck? I thought you wanted me. 
and you are like, I don't know what to say anymore. Okay, that disappoints you very much and confuse you. <clears throat> they are confusing you this way. I'm sorry. It's because they haven't been making the decision 100% yet about the other person and you. They don't want to just play with you and hurt you. And they don't want to really like you know, take a step forward with you. Then they pull away because the other person is still in the picture. It just is really pff, cuckoo, you know. They are going crazy about their emotions and feelings at this time. Okay. He or she will turn around at this time and they will come to you. In this month, they're going to see more shed lights or see the light about approaching you and opening up. They see that you are confident, you keep your peace, you don't chase after them, you don't get too emotional, you are getting stronger about your divorce or about your separation from your ex, and you are fine and you look so good, you look very beautiful. They like your boobies though, I'm sorry. <laughs> If you are a woman <laughs> okay um, mostly they like you when you are so strong and powerful and you speak really very nice and you are not really crying over your ex and say my ex did me wrong and my ex did this and that you know they don't want the, the drama and I think I think most people they don't like the drama or to hear the drama they see you like you know, strong or powerful, like you know, about your separation. You let it go. You are, you are more happy, and you look really so good and nice, and and they like that about you. And they see you like you know, in a different eye right now. It's like you know, oh my God, look what I have been missing. I have been wasting so much time. Where she have been? It's like you have been really surrounded with negative. It seems to be that you, Gemini worked on yourself for a long time and pushed away all of this negativity you are not clouded anymore when you are in negative energy nobody notice you okay and now you are opening up you are letting go a lot you are forgiving you forgive yourself mostly you want to be happy you don't want to be living in the drama and this person the one you are in love with they see you in a different eye that's why they want to return to you or come to you why this why it says he returned to you, which is this person never been with you? Because in the, in the past year, they fall in love with you. But they pulled away because the other person in their life was giving them so much drama and they were watching them and spying on them. That's why they haven't been coming to you. And beside, they notice that you have been back and forth with your ex. <clears throat> excuse me and you haven't been making that decision about leaving them completely that's why they slow down they had their own problems too if you take your ex again and they see your ex you're gonna slow down this like they're gonna approach you now so you better let go of your ex because you know how much deceitful this person was Beside the lies and everything that happened. You don't want to connect with them. You learned your lesson. That's enough. Of course, it goes up to you what to do. But these are the messages here and I have to say it. They see you confident and you're speaking very well. And you are very, very shiny here. And look at that energy. You are glowing really very much and they love it. They want to return and approach you with love. They, they are going to give you that message of love really very strong and clear. They are not going to be fag about it. Finally. Oh my God. You have been really feeling insecurity a little bit. But you're going to be family. 
They have been watching over you. They like you. They want you. You have been waiting forever. Oh my God. It has been a long time, huh? So they tell you here, you need to relax. This is a great start, but you have to be really taking that action not to be back and forth about your ex because it's giving you some sort of like you no know, fear, confusion, um, insecurity. Like every time you want to see yourself happy moving forward and feeling really better, you just destroy it for yourself to feel insecure. And if uh, because you get this is about your ex, uh, because you felt like you know they give you the attention, they spoil you before, and and suddenly they pull their attention. And you felt like, you know, oh my God, I'm losing. The, am I making the right decision to leave them? Did I rush into that divorce or that separation? You did not rush, actually. The universe have been really screaming out loud to you to leave them a long time ago. But you have been, been in denial to yourself, um, feeling that maybe it's your fault you did this because the other person, the ex, manipulate you, lied to you, and switch the table around on you that it is your fault, but it's not. Okay, you need to learn that and be strong and firm at this time and make a decision. Because if you make that decision, you're going to be very happy with this actual person that you are in love with. <clears throat> Excuse me, I don't know what's wrong with my voice suddenly. This person wants you. Oh my God, they love you so much. You're going to possibly will have a kiss and I am waiting for that kiss to see. Please, just... Whatever happened, just write these comments down there and tell me it happened. I want to know. Share with me, please. Okay. There is a good news. You learned your lesson from the past. You learned your lesson from other relationships from the past. You know how to free yourself and be good to yourself. At the end, there is that commitment and love and fulfillment with this new person. I'm going to call him the new person. Okay. He could be an air, 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 air sign person. But it's not necessary, but it feels to me that he or she is an air sign like you. It could be a Gemini like you also. They approach you in love and you are going to be really in love and happy. Okay, what advice will be giving for this month for Gemini? Regards to love and relationship. I'm happy for you. Enjoy your time. This is really beautiful. And you see most of lies about your ex. You know, it says here, isolate the ex. Isolate them. I'm not really trying to control your relationships here, but I'm telling you, just isolate them. <laughs> what advice will be giving for Gemini for this month? November 2019. They all want to want to fall down. Oh my God! Lots of messages possibly here. There is a heart to heart conversation, which is a nice thing. Keep an open mind. You know, whatever this one, the new person. I'm gonna call him the new person because he never been with you. Okay. Whatever they tell you at this time, you have to open your mind. You cannot really come across like you no know, as controlling. No, no. I I don't want to be with you that way. There are, like, you know, this person needs some time to adjust his or her living as they are managing of an ending of another relationship. So you have to open your, your mind and there is a very romantic feeling between you two. This is beautiful. Some red flags here and there. I see it. It's okay. They might really like, it's not really like, you know, they are lying a lot about, they can be over uh, presenting themselves to you, which is, you know, them already. These are the things that is going to be really in the way a little bit here, but it's okay. At the end, at the end here, there is that engagement engagement okay you are going to be happy oh my god it's really beautiful it's all about love love is beautiful enjoy it and i hope you like the reading gemini you need a private reading please contact me on my website
as mysticalaziza.com. You have a very nice and wonderful day. Okay? Thank you very much. Bye.